It's been nearly a full year since Donald Trump set foot in the Oval Office, and his administration he has been riddled with scandals and endless controversies, leading some people to truly believe he is the worst president in the nation's history. Trump's approval rating during his first year in office has stayed around a low of 35 percent, the worst record of any president, according to Gallup. Further, a recent Morris poll released in October found that more than 40 percent of Americans think Trump will be remembered as one of the worst U.S. presidents. But polls are not the only indicator that suggests that Trump will low down in history as the worst president ever. From lawmakers to celebrities, all kinds of Americans have come forward to pronounce President Trump as the worst U.S. president of all time. Senator Bernie Sanders said at an activism event last year that perhaps Trump is the worst and most dangerous president in the history of our country. Washington Post columnist George Will wrote a scathing review of the presidency in December and faced plenty of public scrutiny for calling Trump the nation's worst president. Representative Adam Schiff blasted President Trump in a tweet storm in November, writing, there is absolutely no doubt, President Trump is the worst president in modern history. And each day, he works on eliminating modern from that description. Congresswoman Maxine Waters, who has a wildly prolific following for not backing down to Trump, told The Breakfast Club radio show in August that Trump was the worst I've ever seen. The worst I've ever experienced. I think he believes in nothing. I think that he cares about nothing. I think that he's capable of doing outrageous things. Dan Rather, whose fame sprouted from his work as a news anchor, wrote on Facebook in March that Trump had the worst start to a time in office I have ever seen. Billy Joe Armstrong, who is most famous for his song American Idiot, wrote an anti-Trump letter on Instagram, saying, You will now officially go down as truly the worst president in the history of the United States. You are unqualified. You are a bigoted half-wit asshole reality star that has made America a joke to the rest of the world. During a speech about the Trump era, DNC Chairman Tom Perez said, they're going to ask the question of all of us, where were you in 2017 when we had the worst president in the history of the United States? We will be able to say that the Democratic Party led the resistance and made sure this was a one-term president. Urban Dictionary, when you search Donald Trump in Urban Dictionary, the top definition is America's worst president ever. What do you think? Is Donald Trump the worst president in U.S. history?